The objective of this short little video is to help you describe what you're wearing using clothing and colors and applying our rules for matching gender and number and when you're using adjectives, colors are a type of adjective. Right now you can write this down. You're gonna talk about what you're wearing. Don't copy what I'm wearing. So you're gonna write yo uso. All of you write that, males and females. And then you're gonna pick the first item of clothing you're wearing today. Make sure there's at least three. So I'm starting with a chaqueta. So I'm gonna write chaqueta, because you put clothing first. Once I've written chaqueta, then I'm gonna add the color, and the color is going to be blue, azul. And azul ends in a letter other than O, so it's not gonna change. I'll give you a quick little rule. Only O changes to A. E stays E. L stays L, S stays S. Only O changes to A. So only O's change when you're matching a color to a noun. So a soul stays like that, I add my comma. But if I would have been wearing a black jacket and I would have put negro, I would have had to have changed the negro, which does not match chaqueta, which is feminine, to negra so that the gender would be the same. So I would have had to have changed it. So after the comma, I'm going to put my next item of clothing, which today is a vestido. So I'm going to write vestido. And vestido ends in an O, even though it's for women. And it's yellow, so it's amarillo. Amarillo is already an O, and only O's change to A, so I don't have to change anything. And then I'm wearing sandals. Sandals is nice because I'm gonna, it does end in an A and it's also plural, so it applies the gender rule and the number rule. So sandalias. Okay, now sandalias is both feminine and plural. So it ends in AS. And mine have, I'm gonna pretend that they're white. So if mine were blanco, blanco needs to change because O's change to A to match the noun. So that was sandalias. This has to change to blanc cas. So I need to add an E here because you're gonna put and just before the last thing. So when we check our work, you're gonna underline all the items of clothing, which are our nouns. And then you're gonna check each one to make sure that the noun came first and the color came after, which is our adjective. So the clothing first, color next. You're gonna to check to make sure that they match for number. That means plural and singular. And remember, it's the adjective that has to match the noun. So this was plural, so you had to make the adjective plural. You also wanna make sure that you match for gender. And so sandalia sends an A, so it's feminine. So blanco had to change to blancas. You did not have to change a soul because a soul didn't end in an O, and only O's change to A. Write down what you're wearing following the rules we've talked about today. We'll have a chance in our breakouts for you to give each other feedback on what you wrote, and we'll see how we did. Thank you very much.